Previously on Guam Tech. Get him! Thanks again, loyal friend. You really know how to make sure that I'm taken care of. But you know, people on the internet, they've been asking questions about you. As we all know, people on the internet have to have their answers to their questions. They want to know what you're made up of. What kind of parts you have. And I know that you just can't wait to show off your parts. Well, that was sinister, but we're all here to go ahead and take a look at the parts of the Flying Eagle anki do skates, so might as well go ahead and break them down piece by piece, shall we? Of course, Flying Eagle liner, one of the best liners that I've thought in a long time. It's uh, really thin and looks pretty freaking awesome. I really like the uh, carbon stitching. It's a, it's a liner. It's a liner. It has holes. They, they work. Feel good. But uh, <laughs> uh, moving on to the next part, uh, we have the boot. Plastic boot. They're a little bit harder than the not uh, hard boots, like the soft boot, carbon skates. Sometimes those are hard though. This one doesn't have a crap ton of give. I'm uh, gonna say that it falls under the same lines of like a rollerblade solo or something. So, uh, we have. Uh, let's do some of the parts. A nifty little slide protector here. I don't know if you can see it very well. You know, I don't see a lot of these on most rollerblades these days. I don't think a lot of people expect them to be on there anymore, but it's gonna make your skate last a little bit longer, and plus you can get them in different colors and stuff, dude. You can totally, like, represent that color technology, brah. So we uh, move on to the next part. That wheels and frame. Friendly wheels and frame. The frame is pretty freaking thick, actually. It's got some thickness to it, on par with, like, a Kaiser power blade frame mixed in with like a ground control too because you have like the little knobs from a ground control big frame I know a lot of people don't want to catch on stuff and with the wheels 66 millimeter they fit pretty nicely in here as you can tell because I didn't want to take one out slide really well man pretty tall but I like that actually it helps my frames lock on to ledges and lastly the one thing I think everybody's most excited about, the uh, spirit plate. It's pretty awesome. Apparently, turns any uh, 175 mount skate, maybe it's 165 mount skate, pretty much a free skate that doesn't have the Trinity mount. Uh, turns any one of them into a uh, aggressive skate. And I've seen a couple pictures online already of some other Flying Eagle skates. And uh, I think Ricardo Lino had like a really cool picture or something of one of his skates that had the sole plate on it too. I'll post those up so you can go ahead and look at them, right? Pow! Cool! I might have to look towards a pair of carbon skates from Flying Eagle soon and uh, see if these little bad boys might go ahead and fit on them. Regular negative sole plate, regular positive sole plate. About the size of a USD Aon or like USD 7, so. I love it! You tore us apart! You tore us apart! Ah, oh my god! They're coming alive! Seems as though my actions will have immediate repercussions! 
For this, you'll pay the ultimate price. Ultimate price. Oh, ultimate price. <laughs> Actually, what am I talking about? Like, there's really no problem with this at all. It's just a rollerblade, and uh, I really don't think I have anything to worry about. Oh, yeah, we used to have to put us back together! <laughs> well, I'm better than a freshly put together pair of skates. Well, I really don't think I need any help with any of my skating or anything like that, but, I mean, people do crazier things on their phones these days, am I right? Uh -oh. What? What the fuck? Look at him coming in! <laughs> Hell, man, you just busted into my house like that? Who the hell are you? What do you want? Hey, kid, you called me. I just go where the talent is. Why don't you come take a seat with Uncle Vonka and he'll explain a few things? Come on! Alright, man, like, you better fucking have something good to say. So, who the hell are you again? I'm a legendary blader turned town scout, Diddy Vanka. So, I don't think I've ever heard of <laughs> Hold on, kid, let me tell you why I'm here. You're doing great, Maui. Here you represent that new company out of China. But you need something more. You need Vanka brand gold and laces. Uh, first of all, my name is actually Guam. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And second of all, like, why the fuck would I want gold and laces? Like, I don't even think they're gonna look good in my skates. It's not about how they look, it's how about how good you're gonna skate. And today, I got them at a great price. Just the cost of your soul. Wait. <sighs> oh no, dude, why, why would I even want to take that? That's like a noose, it's a, dude, I don't think that's like even politically correct. Ah, oh, don't get all SJW on me, Amsterdam. Dude, you know what, man? Honestly, you're kind of rude and like weird. And I don't think I want to give you anything for a couple of golden laces. I kind of feel like you're trying to scam me. So I'm going to have to ask you to kindly leave, good sir. All right, Cuba. I can tell you're uncomfortable. But since I like you so much, I'll tell you another way you can get your hands on those laces. You're going to have to go on a sex quest. And when you do, keep your eyes peeled for these. Oh. So, I'm supposed to look out for V-shaped pieces of wax. Find the golden laces, Guam Tech! Meet your potential! Jesus Christ! Thank God that's over! Is that... Is that real? That just happened! Ugh. Well, apparently I got a skate quest or something to go on. All for a couple of freaking golden laces. Everybody knows how freaking lazy I am as it is. But... I guess we're gonna have to go and do this. It's time to get serious. Huh. Come with me, you'll see. Everywhere you go becomes a skate spot. If the ledge don't slide, then you gotta put a bunch of Vonka Vax on it. Even if it's covered in skate stoppers, you glide so fast, you pop them right off. Right on, man. Doesn't matter, tall, short, fat, skinny. 
dog Search around the whole damn city getting lost If you wanna be aces in your place You put them golden laces on Right on man You may find them under a park bench around my greasy neck Yeah, I got you now, motherfucker! They're all yours if you can earn them Or as a gift from a good friend Man, you're lucky I grabbed one of your shirts for you. What about Vanka? What about the laces? Yeah, dude, you keep saying that. I don't know what a Vanka is. <laughs> hey, man, if you're not feeling well, I can always try the Eagles. I've always wanted to. We can do an outside perspective. <laughs> Everything will be fine. I like it. These things I don't want. 